technical heavy, CPU heavy, I guess. But it, it already looks a little bit clearer. So pretty much Origin Access, they only have the Anniversary Edition, which I believe is like two or three years old. Um, but Steam, I realized the base game itself, it's so you, it's thirty dollars for the entire game, uh, along with the DLCs. But on Humble Bundle, it was literally like two dollars for the base game, like ninety nine cents for the little ones DLC, and then also uh, another like three dollars for the three stories that they actually released back in uh, November twenty nineteen. So literally last year, a few months ago. So, I decided I can get the, the Steam achievements, I can restart, and I can get the Final Cut Edition. Plus, I'll be directly, uh, well, basically, actually paying for the game. So, that's what I ended up doing. So, now I have the game through Steam. I have the Final Cut version. Um, looks like it's actually running a little bit better than it was before. And, uh, yeah. So I'm, I'm glad that I did that and um, I'll pretty much be starting my, it's technically my second playthrough, but it'll be my first playthrough on Steam, I guess in a way. So I, we'll see where it goes, honestly. All I did was hit survive, so um, I don't know who it's going to give me. I don't know if it always gives you the same people. Or if it, it randomizes who you start out with. Okay, so. We're back in the house again. Alright, huh. So this is completely different then. Savor and Grans Grasnavia has been raging for years now. Last stronghold of the rebel forces is under siege by the government military. Countless civilians are stranded in the city. Food and vital sources are running out. Every day is a struggle for survival. Christo and his daughter Iskra were given or were driven from their home by soldiers in search of a place to stay. They, they chanced upon an abandoned building, decide to make it their temporary home. Wow. So okay, this time we have the uh, daughter and uh, father. Iskra, my mom is we, is visiting my grandma, so dad looks after me. We will meet again when the soldiers go away. Dad says they will go away when the country sends us help. I hope it's soon. I miss my mom. I miss my friends. I miss my room, TV, and ice cream. Did you know we had to live in the basement? Dad said this was safer than like that. Can we look around here? Okay. What's his? What the? She just teleported all the way down to him. What? What's wrong, dear? Wow, this already looks a lot better. I saw that they did uh, a good amount of graphical updates and stuff too. So right now she's sad, so I wanted to make sure that we had him talk to her. We used to live not far from here. When the first shelling started, we moved into the basement for safety. We tried to make it as comfortable as possible. But it was still cold, dark, and damp. There were also rats. Iskra was afraid of them, but I told her she had to be strong. Well, I went out each day to get some supplies. More bedtime, okay. Yeah, so right now this is all new territory for me. Um... I didn't, my f technically first playthrough, I didn't have any kit, I didn't have the kids DLC, and I didn't have Christo. Um, so, we'll see where this goes. I don't even know what that is either. Make sure we grab all the equipment here. Oh wait, we don't want to have her do that. Can we, are they able to scavenge stuff? Like, can she go grab stuff? Grab all. Mm -mm. 
exit. Okay. What is this? Oh, so it's just... <laughs> Sad she's playing. Interesting. It's almost like having actually one person, but then you just gotta watch over somebody else, too. That's crazy. Why is... I I'm wondering why doesn't Origin have this version of the game? I feel like they're missing out on a lot. Because it makes some pretty big updates from what it seems. Where's she going? Not supposed to touch it. Grab all. Wait, can we have her grab that? Actually? Oh, she can. Nice. Okay, sweet. So she can at least uh, grab some stuff. Let's have him go up there. I'm just going to let her do her own thing right now because she seems pretty upset. Or, well, she was upset. But now she's running around the whole place. <laughs> Did we? Wait, we have a lockpick already? Oh, we do. Sweet. Okay, but the pile's in the way. Now nah, I'm not gonna. No, no, don't do that, dude. It's not worth it. Okay, so I think we got everything we can get right now. I mean, we could open that down there. Uh, we can't open these just yet. We'll see if we can... After we open this door, I'm gonna go ahead and see if we can upgrade this. Yeah, it definitely runs a lot better on uh, Steam than it did on Origin. It's a slight difference. I mean, the game's not too gra graphically heavy. But still, like, you can tell the, uh, the bits of upgrades that we got. Okay, so we're five out of four. Or four out of five, I mean. We got plenty of everything else. Um, I'm gonna hold on to this before making anything. I mean, we could make a bed, actually. It looks like we have enough, too, so... I'll go ahead and make a bed right here. <laughs> Can we have the kid play anywhere? Yeah, go play up there. She draws on the wall. Okay, so let's go ahead and end the day. Bandit Cottage, so yeah, she'll sleep and we'll have him go scavenge for some food at the cottage. Um, we won't take anything with us for now. We need to get a crowbar, so that'll be on the to-do list. Looters must have been here in a hurry, there's still a lot of stuff left. Good, very good. Okay, so let's make sure. I'm hoping that there are some parts. It seems like there might be a good amount here. I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like it would be. But this place seems like it might be each night actually like abandoned. Like there's nobody here at all. It's just like free gather materials type of scenario. But I'm not sure. 
I mean, I don't see any movement inside the house just yet. Okay. Let's just check for some other stuff. I think it's just going to be like slugs and things like that. Um, electric parts. I'm going to put that away for now. Same thing with the shotgun shells. I'd rather take like regular parts and materials between now and then. Definitely want to make sure we clear out this place as much as we can though. Fertilizer. Yeah, I'll drop two of these off. Pick up the fertilizer. Take up that part. Uh, weapons parts were fine for now. I wonder if there's a note in this house like there is in the last one. You can see the animal going up the steps or whatever it is. Nice. Okay. Let's get as many parts as we can. Family photo of the parents and two daughters. Good thing the girls don't resemble their father. He looks like a bear. Whoa. <laughs> Jeez. Raw food. Okay. Actually, I'll take some of that. I want to take this. Um, so we have something for her. Uh, I guess we can drop the components. Okay, nice. Another part. Ooh, we can't get any more. All right, let's let's make an, a run for the exit for now. I feel like we got. Uh, it's a pretty good run for the first day. And we'll, we'll be able to come back and grab more stuff. They're not really hungry just yet. But there's still plenty left to, to come back and grab. Loading. A bit of indulgence. Here we are. And this time I know which icons... Um... I could bring so much every night. Okay, so they're both tired and hungry. She's still sad. Will he give her the, uh, like, teddy bear thing? But look what I brought. Wow, thank you, Daddy. Haha. <laughs> Nice. Okay. Will you tell me a story? Okay. I'm gonna have to wait. 21 Celsius. Okay, right. I forgot to change. Change that to Fahrenheit so I can... I can actually read it. Once they finish talking, uh, we'll see if we can do that upgrade and then make a shovel too, because we need that. Nice. Prove workshop. I'm gonna try not to feed them until we have a working, like, feeding area. But I can't, I don't feel comfortable going more than like three days without it. So I'll hold on to that. Um, geez, this needs 10 things of wood. Simple heater stove herbal workshop compare med her meds bandages and low quality roll up cigarettes okay traps for small animals yeah we need that meat is rare com commodity purify rain and okay armchair 
I mean, we can do the... Let's board up. Let's do that, so that way that's safe. And it will keep us boarded up until at least we, uh... Until something happens. Let's have this kid go... You can go play, kid. Oh, she's playing right now. Okay, so the kid keeps them busy themselves. That's not too bad. Nice. So that's boarded up. Oh, crap. Whoops. Hold on. Sorry, kid. Wait, can the kid actually make stuff? Whoa. It can make a jump rope? <laughs> and a beach ball? Interesting. Oops. Okay. Simple heater radio. Sweet. What's it? What's the one that you make food? Is it this? Okay, yeah, it is. The stove. Which one's the metal workshop? Such as shovels for clearing rubble, crowbars. Okay, that's what we need. Um, let's put this right. Can we put it here? No. Nope. Oh, wait. Could we? Actually. Right there. Yeah, let's put it right there. I need to make a shovel so we can clear out the rest of the place and we'll get we'll get a good amount of materials once we do that too which would be nice good and nice, we can make one. So we should be able to, I don't know if we're gonna have an exactly enough time. It'll be close. Fine, just be careful. I'll see you later. I make your crowbar too. I think it was, if I remember correctly, it said always bring a crowbar with you pretty much everywhere you go. Because even if you can't get everywhere, like when you go to a building, you can at least open it and then come back with the shovel if you need to. Hey, can we make the uh, stove? <gasps> we can. Nice. Yeah, this time I'm putting the stove someplace where it should be. In the kitchen. <laughs> so I read that typically the world lasts until... Uh, it's 20 to 50 days so that typically it's like a three to four to five hour play session each time it all depends on the draw of the luck but we're gonna try to survive all the way through this time if we can okay so we're gonna need some more water um, let's try to run down here can we make anything else? Uh, we can make a filter. What is teach? Do I make a filter? Yeah, I guess so. Let's make a filter. That way we can make enough food. I guess you can teach the kids so they can learn how to make stuff. 
working right now. Very busy. Okay. Running out of time. We'll just make it. We won't be able to finish that. The night. Okay, so at least we're boarded up. Which is good. Hungry and tired. That's alright, we can go back here. Um, I don't think we need anything while we're here. So we're just gonna go in and grab as much as we can. Okay. We'll just start grabbing stuff this time. I'm not sure. I didn't really look at, like, inventory-wise what we need. I know, like, one thing we need is water. So if we can find that... I'll take that. Otherwise, like, it's not a huge deal. Yeah, we're, like, I mean, we're already filled up pretty much. Okay. So we'll need to grab a shovel at one point. Um, I'll drop the shotgun shells. Same thing with the the cigarillo and that for now. Electric parts, that too. I'll take the vegetables. Uh, clean water. So we need to bring a shovel back here. Uh, I'll take the parts, because those always come in handy. Um, drop that for right this second. Okay. First day they robbed us, two days later. If you're reading this, don't look for me. I shot ever. I used a gun anymore. It's broken and buried in the backyard. Okay. So that's the, uh... Sounds like the house always has that. Okay, so we'll need we'll need to bring a crowbar. Or um something else. Okay. Let me go back downstairs. Grab that. Um, actually, shoot, do I grab the gun? We'll, we'll come back here one more time to grab, uh, no, no, I'll take it. I'll take it. I rather, I don't want to lose it just in case. The book we can drop. I'll take this instead. All right, now we're in the exit. Weapons parts, you get a good amount, I feel. I feel like. Nice. Day three. Daddy! <laughs> Uh-oh. We've been raided. Someone broke in. What? I boarded it up. Someone noticed our shelter and has been left on guard for the night and stole our things. We don't know who it was. Things they stole. Been searching and brought some interesting things. Oh my god, man. Really? How evil do you have to be to hurt a child? Wow. She's slightly wounded. That's so bad. Alright, we need to talk her through this. So I boarded up the place just for, like, the place to be broken into anyways. Do you have to board up the place in multiple spots, I guess?
Hungry, slightly wounded, and depressed. Hungry, talking, and very tired. Alright, so we gotta have him. Like, at least rest tonight or something. Alright, let's have her rest up. Uh, let's finish clearing the house and then I'll make them food. Someone's at the door. There's two guys. I'm coming, I'm coming. Okay, fine. We live several blocks from here. We saw you took refuge in this building and we're supposed to be neighbors. We decided to pay you a visit and say hello. We brought some vegetables from our garden. Enjoy. I can give you... Oh my god, yes. Thank you. Great to see you around. Uh, that was kind. Kind of nervous, but... Okay. <laughs> Alright, open this up. Half of our time is already running out for today. Alright, go open that. Alright, she's recovering, so that's good. So meds are used for, um, if you're sick, bandages is if you're, uh, injured, and the other one, I'm not sure, I didn't really use the, the herbs yet. It'd be nice if we had one more person that could go through some of this stuff. I don't know if the kid can do that though. So we're halfway through the day. All right, our shovel's doing pretty good so far too. Try to open both of these up. I feel like the materials they give you is better now, or something. I feel like we're, like, better off. I'm actually pretty excited to do, like, the full-on stories eventually, too. Okay, so let's try making a meal for, the, for her and him. Okay, so... Two meals. Can we make two? We can't. Dude, awesome. Yeah, we'll be set on food for a little bit here. And then I'm gonna try to board up the place some more before the night. Perfect. Last one. Four o'clock. We have exactly four hours left for him. All right, good. So we'll have him eat one. Just to take him down. All right, that'll do for now. We'll have her eat one. Realize this audio is not working for my other PC. Okay, 
but I want to board up. One sec, I just want to make sure that this is enabled too. Sound setting, control panel. Usually it is. Okay, it is enable. One sec. So we need to test one more thing. Usually that does it. Just want to make sure. Yep, it fixes it. I don't know why that happens. Kind of weird, but whatever. Where is he going? I already shoot for five stars. Oh, he's going to board up, right? Forgot. Where's he boarding up at, though? Right here? Well fed, slightly wounded, sad. Alright, let's make sure she goes rest. I know, kid, I know. Oh, we have bandages? Oh, I guess we found some in the house. Oh, man. Kids are the hardest part for this. Very tired, shoot, man. I uh, we'll make one more run. I mean, or we could just have them rest for the night. Yeah, let's have him rest for the night because he's very tired. Night was calm. All right, good. There's still a good amount of stuff we can grab inside the house, so it might be able to, um, can we board up the house more? Doesn't look like it. Guitar. Swing. Radio. Eater. Uh, rainwater collector. We have a filter made. Let's do a rainwater collector, I guess. Or should we, wait, we need the, the small, the pet thing. But we need parts in order to do that. All right, I'll do rainwater collector. Yeah, we'll place it right there. Or, hmm. So I have two meals left, some vegetables, and other stuff. Uh, I'll clear out the house after I'm done with this. What's her bio say? I don't like this place, but it's better than our basement. It was dark and damp in there, and there are some rats living there. I hope there are no rats here. I'm afraid of rats. Rats, they're icky. Climb over you when you're asleep, and they can bite you. The true nightmare fuel. Let's have the kid go play. Go play up here.
Nice. Just make some. Okay, sweet. So we can go clear this out now. Oh, someone's at the door. Can we have the kid continue to do that? Hey man, who is this, Franco? I, isn't he, he's the one that's like, buy all the wood from him. You can have it for almost nothing, okay. And that'll save me from going out a lot. Fine, we have a deal. All right, deal. Good for now. After I clear this up. Two more. Not armed, I just want to trade. I'll see if there's anything else I can trade with him after this. See if he has any, has any parts. Diary finished ransacking. Daddy? In a trade. Okay. Um. Let's see if we can take the majority of his materials. I don't really want the cubes of ice or that. Or actually, there's 10. And then will you take it or will you... Hmm. That's not worth it. You won't make it if your provisions run out. What? Oh, I thought that was the kid, the guy talking. I had something in my eye, that's all. Let's see if we can make anything else. Come on, I know you're there. Dude, he's kneeling right in front of you. They're hugging through the door. So what's it gonna be? Uh, 
Uh, okay. Metal workshop allows us to make shovel. Oh, we already have one. Stove, we already have one. Board up. All right, yeah, let's do that. I think it's because we opened up the new area. Yeah. Yep. Should be in school with other kids. Damn this war. I do want to upgrade the workshop at some point too. The metal workshop. Nice. All right, let's have him go back down. do anything there how about this uh, if we had more parts and for components and parts we'd be able to upgrade it and we also need in order to make the trap for small animals we need more components and parts too so that that's our primary right now components and parts primary goal at least and then yeah this we just needs components all right let's have it and end the day okay so she can sleep and some materials some meds lots of weapons lots of parts all right good very good bring the shovel with us and i don't think we need the crowbar so that should be good Oh wait, go back. Pin the head up. Grab all that. Oops. We'll pretty much just grab everything now. Or everything we can. Components. Uh, don't really want that right this second. Components. Let's clear that out the way. Shovel's doing a good job. <laughs> good, I'm glad to hear. Locked. <sighs> Shoot, I forgot. We do need a crowbar. What was this? Is this the, the letter thing? Yeah. Oh man. Alright, well, I kind of ran out of space, anyways. So I guess it's okay. Alright, I'll take that. I'd rather take the components. take the wood too. Okay. Run the exit. I think, if I remember correctly, the, the place is boarded up as much as it could be. So we should be good. Day five. Da 
buddy. Okay, what I got? Night was clean. Searching for surprise supplies. Brought some things. All right, good. Hungry. Let's have her him talk to her first. He's still sad. Once they're done, we can have the kid try to make something. And then once they're done talking to see if we can have him uh, upgrade the, t the workbench. Or actually, no, I want to make the uh, the trap first. Bandages seems to be what we're lowest on. So maybe we should make the, uh, we have a good amount of food, vegetables and stuff. We can make some if we need to. Um, it's only us two right now, so we're pretty set on food. Uh, probably being able to make our own bandages would be best. Cause right now if we get injured or anything, I mean, we'll be okay. But got something for you. Yeah, she can. She can make one. Up. That's fine. Make a jump rope right there. Uh. No, actually, we'll we'll put it in this room. Can we? Hello, neighbor. Are you, are you doing all right? We have to help each other, especially in times like these. I had some trees in the garden, and it's getting colder every day, so I decided to cut them for firewood before anyone else would. I can share some of it with you. Maybe next time you help me out, eh? Yeah. Oh, my God. You 20? Holy crap. Be going now. Should sleep off last night. The last night. Oh. Okay. You need weapon parts to make the next one. It's kind of funny. Okay. We compare herbal meds, bandages, and low quality roll of cigarettes. All right, good. Nice, and I can put it in, in that room. I'm waiting for both of them to get very hungry before feeding again. And I'm waiting for him to get very tired before having him sleep again. Nice. Okay, so pure alcohol. We need that. Uh, herbal meds based on herbs. Sometimes they help, sometimes they don't. They are still better than nothing. Alright, so we need basically um Okay, we need a bunch of alcohol. So, moonshine still? Can make a foul tasting but strong booze we could barter it for things we don't need just don't expect too much all right so we need more parts herbal workshop herbal garden use fertilizer we can grow some herbs here and use them to make medication or cheap cigarettes okay so guitar uh we can't make a radio just yet Damn. Can we up? So we need parts and more parts and components.
All right, I think that's pretty much all we can do for today. Let's have him actually rest for the rest of the day. Nice. So lots of parts, lots of weapons. The food meds. Okay. Let's go to the abandoned cottage again. And this time we'll take the crowbar. Okay. Didn't I say that earlier actually? That every time you go to a place you should bring a crowbar with you? I think I might have said that. <laughs> Yet I didn't bring one a few times. Alright, we should be able to clean clean this place out today. We don't I'm hoping that it's not a lock pick. Okay, yeah, good. I think it's either one. It's a lock pick if you wanna be stealthy. Or crowbar if you wanna break it open. Determined father. Uh, we'll see. I need them parts. Parts and components. I'd open up. Alright, so let's drop the... Is it quality roll up? Quite good under circumstances. So there's some parts. Coffee, sugar, we don't need that much. Not yet, at least. Some meds, I'll take that. Sure, it'll come in handy at some point. Come on, parts. Alright, good enough. Components. Drop the shells for now. That up. Did we even get... We got one part. Actually, one part. Okay. Let's just make sure that we can't grab anything else. Alright, we should be able to make a radio this time, too. Maybe. Okay. Actually, I think I'll take the ammunition. Over the sugar. Yeah. I don't know if I saw any more... On there. Did we check the chimney? None there. Okay. Not sure if I checked the chimney or not. Alright, I think we're we're stocked up. I'm really hoping to upgrade this backpack eventually. Um, I'm gonna actually look that up real quick. So, upgrade inventory. Running doesn't carry as much as Marco, but he can carry more than an average survivor. What? I'm looking... Boris can carry more. Dude, this person asks, is there any way to upgrade your backpack? 
and it's just talking about people i know you can upgrade i'm pretty sure you can't oh wait what but you can get people have bigger inventory for example border 17 and marco 15. really i thought you could just straight up like upgrade your inventory but like even just a tiny bit higher a few extra spots i didn't think that it was like that strict Day six. Daddy. Uh oh. What happened? She wounded? You've been raided. Somebody. What? Mr. Shelter is left unguarded for the night and stole some things. Has been searching for some plot. She got slightly wounded again. Kidding me? I really need that radio. All right, you actually you go rest, kid. I still don't have enough parts for that. Don't have enough parts for that either. All right, let's make this radio. very hungry she's hungry slightly wounded and depressed all right good What's the stories? Stories has four achievements. Someone's at the door. Be right back, kid. I hate it when they do do that. What's his name? Thanks for opening the door. I'm looking for a place to hide away for this time. I was drafted by the rebels, but I didn't want to kill my brothers, so I ran away. They catch me, I'm dead. Let me stay with you. Roman. What's his uh characters if uh what is it? Stats and effects. Uh oh, whoops. Look at most popular. Best tips for a successful game. Making the food. Cooked food with or without vegetables is the same value. Don't cook too much at one time. Can I use this stove for anything else while there's remains? It's getting hot in here. Heater going despite it being warm. A mighty tool crowbars are much much better than lockpicks. The only times a lockpick is useful is when you wish to be stealthy. Crowbar should be one of the first things you create. It lets you look all the uh loot all the locked items in your home base. Keep bad guys up, booting out your uh boarding up your structure requires level two is an imperative to adequate defense. Uh, with the radio mentions that you have, expect always keep a radio at least, keep at least two guards and keep everyone in rep relatively good spirits. Uh, you never need to use medicine or bandages on your survivors as long as they are slightly injured or sick. Send them in bed for some extra rest and make sure the place is warm enough. Having them sleep in a bed overnight as well. They'll heal in a day or so. Okay, so if it's a slightly, they'll be fine. 
Early on, if you rely on scavenging for all your building materials, mid-game components become scarce for looting. Don't forget to trade for sugar when you can. Moonshine slash alcohol is easy to make, but sugar can become quite scarce. Okay. Well, there's a ton at the abandoned place. In mid to late game, scavenging becomes a vehicle for driving trade as as you trade the items you scavenge for our components to upgrade your base slash build filters. If you bring back a little of everything, you'll end up with the mishmash of an inventory. Make runs specifically for components or wood or ammo, meds, clearing obstacles. Know what you want to get before you head out. Trade smart. Don't trade for extra filters. Use general water uh, that you use to generate water. When you just trade for the water, had a better exchange. Know what you want. Okay. Um... Beginner's guide only. Let's see, just real quick. Length 40 days is fine. Uh, first round on easy and consider it a tutorial. Uh, oh, really? Huh. Scavenging locations. Come in three flavors easy, regular, dangerous, armed people occupy the location. You can play this game without ever attacking anyone or stealing from anyone. Mood. Your controlling mood becomes a necessary aspect of the game. Crafting daytime. Okay. Uh I'm just afraid that Roman is gonna be character's guide. Let's see. What is Roman? Have. I'm just afraid he's like one of the people that's here he is Training combat gives 20% boost to attacker attacks uh, Smoker one hit kill any hostile using backstab capable murder with reduced impact would fight at any level of sadness with other characters increase their Can drink even when shot when not sad Never thought I'd end up running and hiding from my buddies, but that's how things turned out. One in three chance. Leaving Roman to guard at night might also make others use less ammunition if the shelter was raided. Alright, sure. We'll let him bring him in. Alright, listen, man. We need the extra help, so... All right, let's have him. Uh, now can he upgrade this? Nope, still not yet. We're gonna need another, a bed or a chair. Um, we still can't make this. What? Oh wait, we we started making one. That's why. All right, let's go check the radio. Should still be nice and warm. Recent shortages, prices, cigarettes and tobacco have become exceedingly high. To repair on the casualty, there's a bit. Okay. Not bad. At least now we can have somebody guard. It says I could use some rest. Uh, yeah, let's let's let him rest. Wait, is he very tired? He's very hungry though. All right, actually, we do need another bed. All right, now I'm rested. <laughs> Okay. Uh, yeah, I want to make another bed so that way he can sleep too. 